Right now, high school seniors are graduating throughout Milo, and many of them will leave town for higher education. But one ambitious young man has worked hard to earn scholarships to stay right here, where he plans to make his community a better place. As he strolls the campus, he realizes. Every time that I would get discouraged, I knew I had to keep going, keep working hard. It's been a long journey. A lot of ups and downs, a lot of mistakes, a lot of things that I could have done better, a lot of things that I didn't do. But Ismael Basque did do quite a bit. A lot of it is long nights, so I would study like almost every night until like 1, 2 o'clock in the morning, a lot of dedication. In high school, he maintained a strong GPA. 3.9 weighted. Volunteered. Almost 800 at this point of volunteer hours. Lots of selflessness. Giving to others is just what helps me sleep at night. But it's all been worth it. And I get fulfilled by it. And thanks in part to lots of scholarship money. Like 1.8 million. Now, he's going to wash you. I'm just very humbled and very honored to be able to go to a school like this. With the idea of gaining knowledge. And you can have knowledge of like how to help others. In order to give back to his community. Just like change the policies in our community so people can get better access to health care, to mental health resources. I want to go that way. The 17-year-old is already making a difference. Help others do better. When it comes to conflict resolution. As peer mediators and how to resolve their conflicts positively to help reduce the school to prison pipeline, which is very apparent in communities of color. Ismael's ambitions are deep. My hope is just to make even a small impact or even a big impact on as many people as I can to just improve their life, improve their day, or just improve anything really, just to help our society to become better. Right now, he focuses on the process. Keep pushing so I can get to that next step. Of making his hopes reality. What really helps me keep going. And Ismael Batwe wants his journey. Not every day is gonna be good. A lot of days are hard. To also serve as a guideline for others. No matter if you make a mistake or you mess up, you just have to keep going, keep working, keep putting in the hard work. Earlier this month, he received the prestigious Princeton Prize in Race Relations, which is awarded annually to 30 students nationwide.